And, and you know, here's the thing. Uh, we, like, for instance, Tracy and myself, we did not, this thing about cops and conspiracies and all this shit, up until probably not long before the pandemic with the cops, because they started proving themselves before there was ever any word of that. But we, I had been to prison several times and I hung out with some crazy fucking badasses. And yet even they didn't think that there was this level of Truman Show type surveillance going on. No one really suspected exactly how fucking crazy that these people are. But when, after several, since we've been homeless though, there's been so many times where they swoop in with unnecessary amounts of force. They swoop in for no reason and use that force. They, uh, the unmarked cars thing, for instance, there's a, for instance, when my friends used to tell me, oh yeah, that guy's a cop over there. Look at that. Look at that. I would think you crazy ass motherfucker. You're just paranoid out your ass. Now, after seeing unmarked cars pull up at crime scenes and get out with their badges and doing all this shit, after seeing the timing of their uh, operations where they wait and they have certain criteria, once it's passed, all of a sudden they pounce, these are things that are undeniable that you could doubt me all you want. They go on, and there's all kinds of mainstream media fucking corroboration for that. So this is not like I'm, oh, he's just paranoid because he's homeless and a piece of crap or whatever. You know what? I might be a piece of crap in life. But what kind of scumbag motherfucker signs up for a job where he has the power of life and death. They only have six weeks of training. I had twice that amount just going in to get shot, be in boot camp. Why, how is it that these people that are law enforcement, why don't you get off of the track, stop having to run after your criminals, and fucking get your noses into law books and actually learn what crime is and what crime isn't? These stupid motherfuckers up here in the Ventura County Show-Offs Department, they don't fucking know. They honestly don't know. It took, like, I don't know, 20 cops for both Tracy and I to realize that these stupid motherfuckers don't know. They don't know the law. When we tell them, they, they're convinced that they have the right to just throw somebody out onto the street with no notice that they don't have to look at any code. They're convinced that we don't have the right to fly sign. That's a fucking adjudicated by the Supreme Court First Amendment right. There's not even a fucking matter of doubt or debate. Anybody that wants to say, oh, who are you? This dumbass motherfucker tried to tell me oh, that doesn't. that's not the way it goes to California. You fucking stupid piece of shit. You know what? I don't, I hate people that are fucking stupid and ignorant and they drive cars and they live in houses and they have jobs. What gives them the right to fucking have that level of responsibility and luxury when they don't, they never even went to school or when they did, they weren't paying attention. Kids that go to school, that just fuck off their school. I went to school. I might be a bad person, but I still learned how to be bad. These dumbass motherfuckers, they're just compliant. Dude, to be a fucking passive, like, will follow you around fucking by the bull by the horned sheep, fuck that. There's, you know, this thing about, oh, the cops, well, here's the problem. They're hired at a high rate of pay, too many of them, to do a job that they are doing the polar opposite. They want this qualified immunity, but qualified immunity is if they are doing something 
in the course of their job, they it doesn't mean you get to fucking commit murder so that you could watch a murder. It doesn't mean you get to break laws. That's qualified immunity is if you're speeding on the way to a fucking crime scene or an accident or something. It doesn't mean you get to do legal shootings. That's bullshit. There's no, you know, are the courts in California, or they just support that because they want the destruction of California society. And sure enough, it's happening. The dumbass motherfuckers up here in Ventura County think they're impervious to it. They aren't. Los Angeles is creeping up their asshole right now. If you go up into Thousand Oaks, you I guarantee you, you're going to find a lot of fucking homeless people. You go into Oxnard, you'll find some more. Camarillo's snuggled, nestled right there in the middle of them. And they think, oh, well, if we get more, uh, sh- more stringent, we're going to keep them out. You will not. You will not sway the wave of human, the tide of human progress, if that's what you want to call it. Uh, they're not going to keep out the, the fucking flood of humanity that's going to come pouring in, mainly because they have a flood of humanity coming pouring over the border. I'm going to stop there because that would lead me into something that I'm sure would be politically incorrect, and I want you to hear this message. Cops are not your friends. You call them, chances are you're going to jail too.